I just want to see if anybody will jump on, but I, can, I can't tell. What is this lock thing? God, this is going to take me forever to learn. Um, unlock multi-guest check requirements. With this feature, you can invite viewers to join your live as guests. Oh, okay, I know about that. And then host. Yeah, I know about that too. And then what the hell is this? What the heck is that? And what the heck is that? Lighting q and I don't know what this stuff is. Oh, hello. I know you. I didn't know you followed me on TikTok. <laughs> How's the fam? Uh, I'm doing a live for the first time because I thought you'd have to get to a thousand to be on those um, TikTok lives, but apparently not. So I'm like here to, I'm here to stay. And I'll probably just keep talking to myself, honestly, because I want to repurpose this so, so I can maybe post it somewhere else. I don't know. I also don't know what the hell I'm doing because I've never done this before. Oh, I love how my nails match my top. That was not on purpose. Um, how's everybody today? It's like 8.30 here and the sun will be on. On. <laughs> The sun will be on. <laughs> the sun will be around till like 9.30. So I'm trying to get the, the natural lighting. <laughs> My hair is still wet, but it's so it's so hot. It's like I'm always sweating. Always. I can't afford that air air conditioning because they're like five hundred dollars. So um I have a sound machine youtube channel going on right now and it's called it's called airplane do you guys see the airplane airplane noise because let me tell you i have like nosy freaking neighbors not neighbors i'm sorry roommates um i was trying to take like bathroom selfies right and um there's like little blind blind things right and i'm wondering how much you can see someone's like silhouette um with the with the glass right because you can you could totally see that i'm like posing and like the outfit like you could probably see the colors of the silhouettes i'm like oh fuck but i just don't want to be all like caught you know um yeah i've never lived with other people i've always lived by myself for a reason like i've always wanted to but i i'm just starting to get my bearings here so i didn't want to like have to like buy everything so it's kind of nice to like live in a big old house because the kitchen's all set up like i don't need any kitchen stuff lots of things like there's a there's a housekeeper that comes here which is awesome and she's really nice so i don't know it's like the best i could find it's kind of like um living in a dorm but they call it like people who are like young professionals there's like age limits and stuff because like i guess someone told me someone here told me oh yeah i, I wouldn't want to live with like a 50 year old dude and i'm like oh that's why they have age limits i was like i thought they were just ageists um so uh i had the most um <laughs> the most like um like european summer event <laughs> event <laughs> it was just a dinner party but it was pretty fun like i had a really good time like i didn't film it or anything because i was literally living in the moment and um i think it surprised my roommates to be honest because i'm usually pretty quiet so like the fact that they could hear me being loud in the backyard could have been shocking sometimes i shock myself honestly because um like i'm leo rising right so when people first meet me they think i'm so extroverted because my leo rising can really fool you you know 
They're like, no, you're extroverted. I'm like, well, get to know me, man. Because the Pisces is... Yeah, that's like how I think of it. I think of like, your, your, your rising sign is like your life strategy. Like how you try to um, like blend in with the world in a way or try to deal with the world or whatever you like, however you want to say, right? And then your sun sign is like your nature, like like kind of who you are. Um, so I was thinking it's not quite personality because your personality is built up of so many other things. So it's more like your nature, which is for me is very introverted and like elusive. Like like my um, like the people that were there, they were trying to ask me questions, and I'm like, dude, I will talk to you all day. Just don't ask me anything. Um, what does it say? Swipe to what? <laughs> Something just came on my screen. And they said swipe to what? How do I know who's here? Like I know people were here, but that was a while ago. So who else is here? <laughs> Did the people leave is another question. I don't know anything about this. Okay. So anyways, what I, what I was saying was, um, I was like, I was like, I hate, I hate like the attention on me. Like when it when it comes to like like twenty four questions, I freaking hate that. So I try to say that the best way I could, so they would just so I could just cut it, cut it out the roots, you know. I was like, you guys, like I I don't want to do the the question thing because every time there's a question, there's always a follow up question. I'm just not, I'm just not into it, you know. Like I hate what do you do? I hate that one. <laughs> kill me okay so this guy's watching me do a live right now <laughs> i have a lot of neighbors he could hear us too um uh that night that i'm talking about like i'm sure we were pretty loud we were playing music which is pretty sick and i sang which is also pretty sick because you know i'm surprised i got the courage to do so right like i only just met them but it felt good. That part felt really good. Like, I love being performative. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, it was awesome because the guy is from, one of, one, of, one of the roommates have been here like two months. Get ahead, sign up, blah, blah, blah. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Complete quiz. Don't know what's community fest. Don't know what that is. I'm surprised you guys aren't interacting. Um, maybe there's no one here and i'm having a conversation with myself which is fine like i said because i'm gonna put this somewhere else probably i want to save my lives i've been doing lives and i'm not able to save them so i'm gonna do it this time i'm gonna do it this time so where was i so he he's been here like two months right and i only met him like going up the stairs because there's three floors right and then every every um, room has like a bathroom attached to it. So it's sort of like an unspoken rule that we use our own bathrooms. So I'll, I'll do the right thing. And like, if I'm working on my laptop, like in the living room, the common area, I will go upstairs all the way to the top because that's where I am to use my own bathroom. And so he saw me on the, the stairs and started talking to me and, um, I was like, you know what? I came here to pee, actually. <laughs> and he's like, oh, okay. So, so then he's like, invites me to their dinner party, and then he's like, fully Italian. He told me, and he had like really good wine. It was so cliche. And then I, I told him that I was like, I'm a little cliche myself because I've been listening to a lot of Spanish guitar on YouTube while I'm here, just super cheesy. And he's like, oh, we love cliches like nice nice because i i'm just like in that spirit in that spirit okay so then um so then so he's fully italian and then his friend from like many years back like comes and joins us and he's like i think he's half italian half french and he was pretty cool too because um he made like this homemade tiramisu and he was telling me how you make it. Like, I guess you separate it, separate the, the yolk from the egg whites and 
and he's like, you do da da da, and he like explains it. He explains it in a funny way, like da da da. You just do this, you do that, like in a French, like impatient kind of way. And I'm like, I'm like, you should host, you should host an English speaking cook, cooking <laughs> cooking show because the way he explained it was so fucking funny. Anyway, so um, am I allowed to swear here? I hope so. Am I still alive? I better be. Like nothing's happened. Um, I hope you can hear me too because I have a lot going on. I got a fan over here. I got a fan in the back, and then I got the, the sound machine. I want a real sound machine, but this is the best I can do for now. Um, so, so his freaking tiramisu was bomb, and he's like talking about like what it's like to be French. Like versus people who live in the UK, and he was saying that people in London each, it's like they eat like shit or whatever. They eat shit or whatever. I forget what he said, but like their food sucks basically, because <laughs> like French food is like so refined, and he was saying the same thing about Italian, that they're like the best of the best, but they're just different in technique and like the way they cook, right? So that was really sick. Like it was them two, and then it was like another chick who lived in Mexico City forever. And she was telling me about that and how she kind of felt underwhelmed about Paris when she visited because she said Mexico City was a little better. <laughs> I've heard good things about Mexico City, actually. I feel like I'm telling you the entire rundown of what happened. But I don't know, I just thought it was interesting, like what we talked about. Um, yeah, they all seem pretty cool. Um, she's like from the States, so she already left for like two weeks um, with her friend that came. And she she was cool too, Libra. I know all their signs. I know all their signs. And that's the thing about like people who don't believe in signs, like they wanna know so much about you. They wanna know about your family, your siblings. In your entire life right and i'm like dude like i'm like i'm like a what's it called like a delayed delayed gratification like like you're just not gonna get to know me like that like right away like i don't open up especially like for what the hell what the hell for right like just for conversation i don't think so like so so i think people feel nervous about that but i'm like man if you just believed in signs you wouldn't you wouldn't even f like feel unsafe around people because you would already know them so people want to talk so much smack about signs but i'm telling you i'm the one who's feeling pretty good there like not having to wonder who someone is <laughs> you know because that's why they ask like they want to know like everything about you so they feel safe i guess i'm not sure why they want to know so much about you i don't know i don't get people to be honest i don't get it i think my foot's falling asleep ouch 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 um i'm like sitting on my sitting on my leg um so yeah so there's a really pretty like courtyard slash garden slash patio that seats like it's like a like a long table that seats lots of people so it felt like i said it felt a very like like a european dinner party what up thanks for coming so um so i thought that was pretty sick 1984 so where I live, by the way, is that's the passcode to get in to the gates is 1984. So obviously somebody from, yeah. <laughs> so this is my first live, guys. Unlock, unlock live access. Don't know what that is. Unlock live access. But the diamond looks cool. I wonder what happens if I click on it. Nothing. Nothing happens. Did y'all just get notified? Because I have been talking about myself for the longest time. But I'm going to repurpose this so it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, I, I was going to... Um, 
do a live a long time ago. Had I known, had I known I didn't need a thousand followers, because, <sighs> you know, I thought that was the rule. And then, and then, you know, I used to have a TikTok account, got banned, and then had to start from scratch. And, you know, as you know, some of you, if you started during the pandemic, you got like an instant 2,000 followers, like off the bat. So I had to say goodbye to all of them and start from scratch. And now I only have 500 followers. So sad. I only have 500 followers. So because I got banned. No, 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 no. <sighs> yeah. Okay. So what else happened that night? Um, this was like a couple nights ago. It was really pretty. Just a pretty night. Thank God no neighbors complained. But I guess it's because like... Well, we live like in an older, older person's neighborhood. Actually, it's very similar to where I used to live. Like same kind of demographic, like older people. Supposedly, this is like the nicer area of where I live. And so the fact that they didn't complain about the noise is a good thing. But we don't do that often, obviously. But um, not obviously, but we just don't. And um, we were freaking loud, but we stopped at like, 11 30 i want to say thanks for the love more likes can attract viewers keep it up keep what up <laughs> happy started following you cool good to be happy have you guys like seen my videos and stuff i hope so um so much pressure to like to create something better than what you've done before like i keep getting those kinds of tips like online oh create better than the best you've ever had whatever i don't know too much too much um but so 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 this guy um like uh the guy that i was telling you about who's like french he's only here a week he's like visiting so he lives like somewhere between germany and france and um he had like a hybrid accordion with him. So he had to blow through this like piano, like mini piano thing. But he was pretty talented. He's a Pisces too. So what do you, <laughs> what do you know? Like he had like a birthday, like three parts, three days apart from mine. And he knew like a lot of songs. So like we, we did, we did covers <laughs> and sang. <laughs> Probably annoyed everybody else who wasn't, who wasn't joining us like that live here <laughs> but we did it it was fun ah. and then um and then i was like trying to help clean up at the end like but it was early it was like 11 30 it wasn't bad at all and i did a little bit like help a little bit and he's like he, the host was like telling me the host he's like my roommate but the host was telling me like no 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 go to bed go to bed and I was like, I hope this place will be clean. Like, that was my main concern. I was like, make sure it's clean. And they did a good job. Because when I woke up the next day, it was fine. And then the day before that, which I think was last night, I was on customer service for like three hours. I'm not even joking. I think it was like 1 a.m. when I started the chat. And... I fucking finished talking to that guy at 3.30 in the morning. Relentless. Relentless. So basically what happened was Anchor.fm was the platform I used for my podcast. Okay? And when I switched over... No, no, I'm sorry. They switched over. All my freaking episodes had been erased right and it's my fault because i hadn't like kept it up right so my memory about what episode was what was pretty bad like this was like i started i started the podcast like in 2021 i want to say and it's been like three years right and he's trying to he's trying to ask me security questions that i have no idea about but i gave him so many screenshots to prove that it's my podcast like i sent him like files on imovie i sent him files from my computer i sent him the when you click on your youtube studio like the interface 
like how would I have access to my own or how would I like if it wasn't mine why would I have this YouTube channel that's exactly the same as the rest of the anyway so so it wasn't good enough like no matter what I sent them wasn't good enough they wanted a welcome email and I had I had emails that weren't the welcome emails but they were still emails I don't know I guess I I, del I must have deleted a welcome email like why would you need a freaking welcome email okay why would you need that so I probably deleted it and then the ones that I kept weren't good enough and I'm I'm pretty sure they're like days apart and like I don't know this guy was just being so by the book people who are by the book I swear like I don't I don't get it I don't get it companies are crazy because Anyway, so he wanted an episode name of a draft. How are you going to remember years later a draft episode name? Like like okay. When if it if it's a draft, you're not going to care about the title of the episode yet. So the tr the draft could have been anything. It could have been iMovie dot mov, right? Like a, if it's a a video right or mp4 i think they're called dot mp4 it could have been um like what else could it have been um i forget like well that's the thing i didn't know i didn't know and you get and that's another thing you get three tries before they like completely x you out so i wasn't gonna i wasn't gonna start guessing because they were gonna freaking basically not block me but like not give me the chance to get my episodes back so they're like warning me about that and i hate that policy too so it's like the policy about knowing the draft and then the other policy about um whatever you guys are probably bored <laughs> are you thinking of work on your day off <laughs> um uh, well, I don't, I don't really have days off, you know, so, yeah. <laughs> this is last night, though. Last night. There's always a problem, honestly. There's always a problem, like, um, like, uh, there's a deposit that I sent over through a bank transfer, and the number's correct, and the landlord sent me the info. And then next thing I know, they're writing me about, we never got your deposit. And I'm like, what are you talking about? I sent it on the 25th of June, on a Tuesday, whatever. And I showed them the receipt and they're like, we never got it. And, or, or not, not only that, they were like, they were like, um, we don't take bank transfers. And I'm like, then don't email me information about how to do a bank transfer. Like, if you don't do bank transfers. <laughs> odd. Very odd. So now they're investigating what happened there. So things always go wrong, don't they? Like, I hate technology. I don't know if it's a technology thing, but it's always about, like, someone having to stick to a rule so hard they can't help you. Or someone doesn't know enough about how to do their job or yeah they just don't want to accept responsibility because it's usually not the person's fault like the, the what do they call it like the customer it's usually not the customer's fault but you know back in the day when customer customer used to be always right like those days are dead like they it falls on you everything that they do mistake wise falls on you it's crazy um phone number we shared a nice moment there oh you have like a model photo robin hood <laughs> um are you anonymous because your photo looks almost too model-y and then the name you know it's like it's not only the photo but it's phone number that's funny <laughs> um can i join the little box at the bottom 
I don't know, can you? Miley Merchant? Um, I guess. Let me try, let me see what happens. What do I do now? All it says is, um, they're all locked. Pulling gift votes, drawing gifts. I don't know what any of this stuff is. Lighting, Q&A, treasure box, and goodie bag. I have no idea what this stuff is. Like, sorry guys, I have not a clue. Um, so, yeah. Like, this is my first live. I, and even in my 10th live, I, I doubt I'll know how to do anything. Okay? I know how to just show up. How's that? Um, that's all I know. <laughs> um, cool, I got followers just from this live. Oh, and supposedly you get more video views if you do lives, which is sick. Love zits. Finally, people starting to show up to my live. But you're going to have to replay it because I was talking about... Actually, don't replay it because it was a bunch of crap. <laughs> I was talking about it just to complain, basically. Um, but I'm having a good time here so far. Like, I just love it. I love it. I love that it's not, like, super costly. I love the subway being super clean. Like, the subway is, like, airport clean. Airport clean. Like, a shuttle. It looks like subway. Or, uh... Uh, uh, what's it called? A Riz. Like charisma. Thank you. Loves it. <laughs> um, just for you guys. I usually turn it off after. I'm like such a bitch. Just kidding. Well, kind of. <laughs> I'm a bitch when I have to be. Like when it, someone's threatening or something. Or just want something. <laughs> um so oh yeah so um so the subway's here like you have to press a button for it to open right and i don't know how to press a, a stupid button so i felt like an idiot one time i don't like to look like i'm new here i don't like to stare like you know people in different places are gonna look different to you you know like, even if you know kind of in your head what people here look like, they still, like, it's it's such a, it's just all new, so you don't want to stare too hard, you know? So I try not to stare too hard, and I also try not to um, stare at the scenery as well. I just want to blend in so bad, and I want to take my time because... I know I'm gonna be here, so what's the rush in a way? And I don't wanna just look like, I just wanna blend in, like I said, so. What's your question, P. Dide? Why would you pick a diff, why would you pick a name that belongs to somebody else though? Would you rather have cookie dough or dildo? Weird, okay, so what's one item you can't live without and not your phone? Item? followed the live creator oh that's me <laughs> item i mean lots of items i need lots of things i'm a girl like i can't live with, without my hair dryer but i haven't used it even one time since i've been here but i still don't think i can live without it you guys ever watched um space balls where he goes just bring bring how come no one's giving me diamonds i got likes though which is cool but are you not allowed to give me diamonds or what um can you say hi sailor is this a is this a prank because what the hell for what the hell for right my god my god um, okay. I'm just gonna go through these comments just in case I miss something. But so far, maybe I don't wanna read them. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, start getting it, girl. Getting what? <laughs> start getting it, girl. Girl. No. 
Oh, you know what I miss about being single and alone? Okay, two messages. I looked through them, I don't think there's anything. Is a hot dog a white person taco? You guys, come on, like, things are pretty good because, um, my, you no know, one can hear my music and I love to blast my music, but here you can hear everything. It's pretty echoey. It's like tiles and stuff, so, echoey. I don't know how long I've been on live, but I don't want to be here, like, longer than, than I sh should. Um, do you guys like um, get notifications to join my live or did you like search for a live? Is that what happened? Sorry my desk is so messy. It's not that messy, but it looks messier on camera, the desk. I try to like organize it a little bit, but... What up Julio? You know we're in Julio. It is in fact Julio now. I need a calendar grips <laughs> god you're so crazy <laughs> the official dill pickle freaking freaking it people have lost their their freaking minds milk joined whatever happened to old-fashioned names like you know <laughs> what up steven with a smiley face people have no some people have really like unique clever names which is which ain't bad right um so so what i was saying is i think i made the right choice coming um but i'm still getting used to everything so but new york is is um needs work like why is the subway so ugly in new york like the city is so supposedly so rich right i mean i used to do like cater catering attendant stuff which is basically like being a flight attendant but only with offices right and like um the offices that i'd go to man they had money like google has like money like literally looks like a museum like not even an old museum but like a modern Anyways, they have everything too. They have masseuse there and manicurists, nap pods and stuff. And they don't want you to vlog anything because they know that, I guess they know that it's kind of fucked up that they have so much money. <laughs> and then the rest, and there's like so much, um, yeah, like uh, inequality, I guess you want to say. Like the US is just so, um, extreme like with rich and poor you know so i think i like it here better it's a little bit more of an even playing field or something um, which i appreciate so i think that's it for me because it went from like 200 people to like three people so i'm thinking i don't want to stay i don't want to stay Oh, but now maybe it's just because people are anonymous is that what's happening i don't know um cool i think a half an hour is good enough i was gonna be here an hour but i think i've changed my mind i think i said whatever i want to say <laughs> for today i don't want to run out of stuff to say not that i ever could <laughs> um Okay, all right, guys. Take it easy. See you on the flippity flip.